Neighbors understandably worried tonight. Sarah, thank you. And as we said, there is an incredible amount of law enforcement here in Austin right now. CBS Austin's Courtney Shoneman is joining me live here in Southwest Austin tonight. Courtney, you've been out here all day. We know there's an incredible number of officers who are here, but this is not all just to help with the investigation. Yeah, that's right, Hema. We do know that the Texas Department of Public Safety right now is helping provide some of those resources. They're actually helping run patrol in Austin while APD really focuses on this bombing investigation. We also know some of these additional resources are needed to respond to some of those suspicious package calls that are coming into 911. Now today, a special agent with the FBI tells me this case is their top priority. We know there are more than 500 federal agents in Austin right now. 350 of those are special agents with the FBI. And today, more explosive detection canines are being brought in, as well as bomb technicians from the San Antonio Police Department and the Houston Police Department. The FBI also has their criminal profilers here from Quantico and are using every resource necessary to find the serial bomber. Additional teams have been brought to bear here in Austin with the area police departments, the state bomb squad, the federal bomb squads are here. We're bringing in extra bomb techs as we speak to make sure that we can handle every suspicious call that happens here, not just in Austin, but in the surrounding communities as well. Also new today, Texas Governor Greg Abbott announced the state is putting forward $265,000 of emergency funding to help both the Austin Police Department and the Texas Rangers as they continue these post-blast investigations. Important to know that we have the support of the full state here in Austin as we deal with these bombings. Courtney, thank you very much. And this latest bombing really is what can be considered a game changer in this situation because this fourth device indicates that a serial bomber is attacking people across this city right now. While the first first three bombs were motion censored. This one was different. This time the suspect 